yellow. For today's video, I thought, hey, you know what? 2014 is almost over. And I find I am constantly giving suggestions to people, whether it be music, TV shows, products. So I thought, why not just compile it every year into a video of Morgan's Musts of 2014. And to start off, I'm gonna do my must music. Must music. First album you should have is Beyonce by Beyonce. I mean, what are you doing? And my favorite song off that album is Haunted. Next, 1989 by T-Swift, Babe Song on that album in style. And next album of 2014 you should have is TRXYE by Troy Savon. It's an EP, it's like $5. And the song Touch is so freaking good. Now on to my must-see show. I started the show Orphan Black and literally finished it in three days. It's a Canadian show. And there's a character with the last name Cormier, and I literally lost my mind when they were like, Dr. Cormier. I was like, what? Ah! What? Ah! What? Ah! Next, my must reads of 2014. Must my first must read is Grace's Guide The Art of Pretending to Be Grown Up. It's pretty much a guide to everything by one of my favorite YouTubers, so go check it out. Next, I just got this for Christmas. I read the prologue. <laughs> it's Amy Poehler's Yes Please. There is already one Harry Potter reference in the prologue, so she's already won me over. I'm literally not even on chapter one yet. Next, my must-see movies on 2014. I'll make this quick because there's only three good movies of 2014. Movies. First movie you should see is Divergent if you have not seen it. Also read that book if you have not read it. Next movie that I loved was Fault in Our Stars. I loved and hated it because it was so sad and I just cried and cried. And the last movie I love is Guardians of the Galaxy. Once you see those three, there's nothing more you need to see of 2014. <laughs> My must attend to things, annual things that you attend. Must attend. First one is Sundance. If we can get here, I think this one's end of January. Last year we met or saw Ari Plaza, Shailene Woodley, the kid from Everybody Hates Chris. I don't know his name. Daniel Radcliffe, Jerry, Matthew Gray Gabler, and a lot of people come. It's always random each year. Last year was a good year. It's gonna be hard to beat. And the next slash last thing you should attend if you can is Witches Night Out that happens in October in New Brunswick, Canada. Go to it. Watch this video. It'll make you probably maybe want to go to it. My next section is must have. Must have. First things first. I got this awesome scarf. It's a Lululemon scarf. It does like 13 different things. I'll link the video of the girl who knows what she's doing when she does this tutorial. You can do a classic. And then I'm really looking forward to doing this one on the airplane. It's like you go into your little cocoon. I love it. I've been doing this one a lot. Oh, I think that's right. It's like a cool bandana-like thing. You can make like a shirt. <laughs> I have no idea how to do the shirt. There's another cool one. I did this, and then she like tucked. <laughs> this one was called The Traveler, I think. Oh my god, tuck. Tuck. You see that? You get it, you get it. It's the universal scarf. My next must of 2014, you might be wondering, wow, Morgan, how'd your skin go from this to this? Well, I will tell you, kind soul. My mom, one day, just brought home this lotion. And she was like, Morgan, use this. I was like, okay, because my skin was so freaking dry. She brought me this, wrote it in fields, Overnight restorative cream. It's the same makers of Proactive, I believe. So my face looked like this and then <laughs> I started using the cream and then four days, I kid you not, four days later my face was completely clear and my biggest problem was super dry and like peeling skin and that completely cured it. It's a must. It's a must. 
And then I was like, wow, that was such a good product. So I bought the Daily Body Moisturizer, which smells so good that I don't even want to use it. And then I got the lip cream, not lip cream, it's just like a chapstick, speaking of. And lastly, I got this triple defense treatment that you use in the morning. Next. <laughs> so some of you may know that in my things to do when you're home alone video, I talked about Heelys for like two seconds. My cousin bought me, <laughs> he bought me Heelys. I didn't even have to ask. He bought me freaking, freaking Heelys. Heelys. <laughs> and I was so happy when I got them. I thought I was being sponsored by Feelies, but can we just take a moment? At 19 years old, I got Heelys for Christmas. I'm living my childhood dream. Next on my list is these. Oh my God, this is gonna be hard. So my brother came back from Korea and he got me the most adorable socks. Like I have never seen a cuter sock here. Like look at that sock. I can't even, like at the little stripes. And lastly, me and my mom both got the same running shoes because mine are like four years old. We got these Reebok CrossFit ones and they fit so perfectly, but these are so comfy. I just think this net toe thing is so cool, but I just really love them and I would say they're a must. Here, I'll put them on. Like, see that? They have all of the grips and they're just beautiful shoes. <laughs> See that? Ow. I think they're cool. And lastly, your last must that you have to do is subscribe to Simply Confuse. Hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Eat, eat. Ow. And let me know in the comments what your musts of 2014 are so I can go check them out and see what I missed. And I will see you all next year, next year, next year. Peace out.